For the past half dozen years, Harold French has walked alongside his fellow veterans in Catanning's annual Memorial Day Parade. And even as Veteran of the Year, French said he would rather walk. Uh, I'm involved in a lot of veterans activities, and I don't do it for the recognition, I do it to help my fellow veterans. The past American Veterans Post 13 commander said he declined the Veteran of the Year honor in the past, but fellow veterans snuck it in while he was on vacation this year. French will think about a lot while he completes his Memorial Day speech this weekend. I think of my family that has passed on, yeah. that served. I think of my friends from high school that were killed in Vietnam. think of all the veterans from World War II who they were the greatest generation. A native of Typewriter Hill in Catanning, French went into the U.S. Navy just like his father, Richard, and uncles had. Navy family, that's all we ever heard growing up. French served in Iceland and Greece with the U.S. Navy from 1964 to 1968 before his honorable discharge. He was involved in naval communications. After returning to Ford City, French worked at Elger, Allegheny Ludlum, and finally as postmaster of Freeport Post Office. He retired six years ago. French recalled that during his 50th high school reunion at the 10th Street Station, students honored the nearly 60 military personnel from the Ford City High class, giving them letters of appreciation, their respective branch pins, and playing their military anthem. Before Monday's Memorial Day speech about commitment and duty, French, also a member of the Armstrong County Honor Guard and still an American veterans officer, will also give a speech in Cowansville and plans to attend the Ford City Memorial Day candlelight service. Everybody seems to think that once they get their discharge, that that's it, you know, but you just volunteer to serve your country, and I've been out for 45 years, over 45 years, I'm still trying to serve it and help my fellow veterans. The oldest of seven brothers and sisters, French's youngest brother, Robert, also served in the U.S. Navy. French's two sons are out of town, but his youngest son, Tyler, will travel from Lower Burrow for Monday's ceremony. French, also a former volunteer firefighter, also has twin grandsons and a granddaughter that will also come to the Catanning Parade. Decorated Vietnam War veteran Staff Sergeant Richard J. Kunzelman was the featured speaker last year. Kunzelman, who is the designated caretaker of the Vietnam Memorial in the Riverfront Park with wife Pam, has earned many decorations during his nearly 12 years of military service, such as the Purple Heart, Bronze Star Medal for Valor, and the Security Police Combat Badge. Katani No. 6 Fire Chief Scott Klein will MC the Riverfront Park ceremony while his father, No. 4 Fire Chief Burrow Fire Marshal and Vietnam veteran Earl Buzz Klein coordinated the parade route. Uh, it'll start up by the middle school and go up Bond Street to North Grand Avenue, south on North Grand to Market, Market down to Jefferson. Then it'll turn left on Jefferson, and go one block to Jacob Street, and then right on Jacob, and end up in the uh, entrance to the park. He expected about 40 units in the parade, including the Armstrong Senior High and Catani Firemen's Bands, a handful of floats, and local fire departments and police officers. It's probably the biggest Memorial Day in the parade in the county. Buzz has been on the parade committee with his wife, Donna, since its reorganization along with retired U.S. Army Colonel Jack Bennett, Ford City veteran Don King, and French. Buzz graduated from Ford City with French. Buzz earned six medals during his service with the U.S. Army and was a clerk personal specialist before being honorably discharged. He is also a member of Post 4843 in Ford City. The sons of the Union veterans of the Civil War will conduct the service immediately following the parade. Catanic firefighters and their families put more than 1,400 flags at veterans' graves in the three cemeteries last Sunday.